Hi everyone, this is Ron with Happy Homes with the walkthrough video tour of 356 Spindlewood Way in West Ashley, Charleston, South Carolina. This home is situated just off of Bees Ferry Road, which is very convenient to I-526 and the airports. Um, you know, West Ashley has become kind of its own little mecca where there's lots of shops and restaurant options uh, in the area and lots of new beautiful homes like this one that you're about to see. I'm just going to kind of take a quick pan of the neighborhood. This is a townhouse community, but as you can see, it's kind of uh, really brand new. <laughs> it's so brand new, it's, it's shiny. Um, but the house has been lived in, so uh, you won't have to deal with it, you know, trying it out for the first time. The homeowner did that for you and now it's perfect and ready to go. So without further ado, let's take a walk inside and take a look. This home is a smart home. You'll hear and see some features of that um, almost immediately as we see the ring doorbell on the front of the house, which will convey um, where you can set up your account. Uh, there's the ring doorbell right there. You'll also hear an announcement as we walk in. Oh, I guess because the door was opened, it wasn't quite. So this is one of my favorite parts about the home and it's gonna be kind of hard to show on video, but this foyer is super cool. It kind of opens up to the living areas. Um, and also right here, we're gonna go ahead and check out the fourth bedroom. It was an unfinished space when the homeowner moved in and he finished it out and made it a really cool kind of fourth bedroom and could be used, you know, for other purposes, most certainly. But he has it set up as a bedroom, which you'll see. Okay, for starters, you got one really deep closet right here. Lots of storage space. Spin around and he has a full bath set up here with a sink cabinet full-size shower and nice you'll see this kind of faux gray wood flooring throughout and this nice gray carpet um, in the bedroom areas really large room down here this is about a queen size bed actually it might be full size uh, but just slightly smaller than a queen, but you can see you've got a full-size desk right next to it Across the room. You've got a couple of closet Areas with a full-size dresser this Room does have its own little patio I'll Take a quick walk out there so you can check that out a little small knee wall here opens straight up to the backyard um, You know a little patio area kind of pan around here you can see the quiet space in the back okay let's check out the garage real quick because it's right here now this is currently set up as a weight room it's a one and a half car garage so it's pretty sizable um, once all this stuff is moved, it'd be a nice clean garage area. Okay, let's head up and check out the living areas. Again, nice wide open kind of foyer area here. Just gives it this wide open feeling right when you walk in the door. And that's like a 75 inch TV right there to give you an idea how spacious the living room is. I'm gonna kind of walk into the living room and pan around so you can see this wide open floor plan here and how this is laid out. Plenty of space here, that's a full size couch, but there you could easily fit a few more pieces in here and not have it feel cramped. Right next door, little dining space. And there's lots of large closets in the house um, for extra storage. This is kind of a utility closet set up here. And here's your kitchen. Beautiful countertops. 
vessel, not vessel sink, but a deep sink with a sprayer nozzle. All, all the appliances convey. You've got the over the stove microwave with vent hood, gas fire stove for those of you that like to cook, oven, and then your dishwasher here next to the sink, French door, refrigerator. Um, and again, here's part of the smart home technology here plugged in next to the sink. Um, I'm going to kind of go through quickly from this point, check out the bedrooms. You do have a nice little deck here. You got some ePay decking uh, and a nice little seating area out here to enjoy nature right off of the kitchen. Here is your half bath. Light comes on automatically. And large pantry. Again, right here next to the kitchen. All right, let's go check out the bedrooms. They're upstairs. The other three bedrooms, I should say. Let's check out the two guest bedrooms first. Again, super large closet here. Little linen closet. Hall bath that supports the guest rooms with a shower and tub. The two guest rooms, here's one. These are both good size. We've got a full size French door closet over there. And then this is currently being used for storage, but again, another good size bath with French door closet on that wall. Here's your linen area. Plenty large right outside all the bedrooms. Very convenient for doing the laundry. And here's the master. There is a currently a full size sofa in here. You can see sectional desk and bed. Of course, you can set it up completely different. But this is how it is currently arranged. Lots of space. Let's check out the bathroom here. This is kind of a shotgun style long bath. Here's your dual sink vanity, gray cabinets. Nice tile in the master bath here. Long sink. And then, ooh, what's happening here? You've got your full size shower. And check out the tile there and see that here is the lavatory next door to it it's in its own private room and then here is your uh, master closet they've got a few boxes in here to give you an idea how much storage space there is uh, as well as hanging space and then I wanted to show you this real quick here's your smart home cabinet Got your internet, the ring doorbell, uh, and some other options that we'll highlight in the uh, write-up of the home. So check out that. You can go check out our write-up at happyhomespm.com, or you can give us a call at 843-608-8845 if you'd like more information on this home. I want to thank you for watching our walkthrough video tour of 356 Spindlewood Way. And I hope you all have a great day.